Yes, lads and ladies, how's it going? Max here, and today, welcome back to another match review. Now, Spurs have just travelled up to Wolves, and we have beat them 2-1 at Molyneux, and we've probably come away very lucky, to be honest, because by watching it on the telly, Spurs got lucky, let's face it. Wolves had many chances, and Adama Traore, the guy scored a screamer, and Spurs just looked a bit shaky at the back, but nothing new there. Eric Dyer in midfield, tackles going in left, right, and centre, yellow cards flying about. Even Harry Kane got booked, and you know when Harry Kane gets booked, you know things are serious, because the guy's like the nicest fella on the pitch, and like I don't understand all the hate he always gets. But anyway, result aside... Three, well, three points. Three points is good. We're back up there and we're suddenly, it's not even looking like a bad season at the moment. And since Mourinho's come in, that's exactly what we wanted. And this is the reason he's here, to get us these results, to grind us out the Mourinho way. I don't really care if we're, we're not battering teams. If we're getting the result, that is what matters. And Son, what am I about Son for? Sorry, Son, Son's been playing brilliant recently and he scored that wonder goal the other day, so I wanted to talk about him. But Lucas Moura, the main man, he got on the score sheet with an absolute thunderbolt, great solo goal, knocked it past the defender from an acute angle and smashed it into the roof of the net. Absolute class goal. Love Lucas. I'm just glad he's getting game time now. And now with Son, Deli, Lucas and Kane starting up front nearly every game for us, it's it's looking good. It's looking good when we're attacking. But the defensive side of things are abysmal, honestly. I mean, Wolves are a good side, but when you come up against these big teams, you can't be defending like that. And I feel like in January, Jose's going to sort that out because a Tra Traore scored a screamer. I mean, we, uh, we defended set pieces well. But when someone like Yama Tomlin is playing left back, Traor is going to be roasting him all day long. The guy's got like 99 pace on FIFA and Vertonghen's got like 68. So there you go. You can work that one out. But anyway, the second goal came very, very late on and that was through Ericsson coming on. Believe it or not, I don't know why the first sub was only made in the 88th minute, but it was. Ericsson came on for Lucas Moura, actually. And what was it for Son? I think it might have been for Son, actually. Either way, Ericsson took the corner and Jan Vertonghen from a header, from a corner, believe it or not, put it bottom corner and the keeper had no chance, and that was all from a stupid foul from the Wolves player. I can't even, I think Dong Onko, whatever his name is, I think he got a booking as well. But anyway, that got us a goal in the last minute of the game, which was just, oh, that's what it's all about. That is what it's all about, these last gasp chances, and you know Supi Yan doing that famous celebration, the Super Mate Supi Yan celebration. So 2-1, I actually predicted 2-1 over on my Instagram. And just a little plug, if you're not following my Instagram, it's xjoymax. So go check it out. I'm nearly on 8,000 followers over there. So go check that out. And uh, if you guys end up winning the, um, guessing the score prediction right, I, I drop you guys a follow. Simple as that. So check that out. What else was there to watch today? I mean, I only managed to see bits because I saw it on the telly and the quality of the, the uh, the viewing, shall I say, wasn't exactly up to scratch. It, it kept freezing from time to time. So that was a bit unfortunate. And uh, the reason I didn't travel up there was because, well, it was pissing it down with rain. Who wants to go up there and sit in there and watch that and get wet all game? I mean, I missed out on scenes, but I'll be there for the Chelsea game. Be back at the lane next week. So I'll be there. I'll see you guys there for that. Up the Spurs, three points. We're back up the table. And I'll see you guys soon for another video. Take care. Bye-bye for now.